All right, we're back at Eagle Springs, hole two, my favorite hole. But today we're doing something a little bit different. We're testing some new golf balls from Snell Golf. I've got the MTB Prime and the MTB Prime X. So I'm gonna be playing both of these two golf balls today, giving you guys some feedback of what I like, what I don't like. I'm gonna be playing the Prime X first today. I just gotta draw a little bit. Oh, that one's going right at it, a little right. All right, that's two on the green. All right, we've got two decent tee shots here. We got the Prime X here, and I got the Prime maybe four feet closer. Oh, all right. All right, 113, which is essentially a full gap wedge for me. All right, I've got the prime, middle of the fairway, maybe a few yards closer than that. All right, both balls rolled off the back of the green, so we're putting though, don't worry about it. Just a quick durability note. I did take this one straight off of a tree, and you know, as can be expected, we got a little little cut here. But overall, this ball's been holding up pretty well. All right, 130, 131. No wind to speak of. Going with the X first. Played the round, played with both the Snell MTB Prime X and the Prime. And I have to say, for someone, I've never played these golf balls before, certainly never played the newest version of them, and I was really pleasantly surprised. I've typically played the Pro V1X in the past and also the TaylorMade TP5, and they both seem to play very similar to them. For me, I'm a field player, so the Prime was a little bit softer, and that's something that I, I like, but I was hitting the Prime X a mile, so I don't know all of the exact specs of it, but you know, they're both three-piece urethane golf balls. They both held up on the cart path, off a couple trees, in the bunker. So yeah, really overall impressed. Like I said, for me, I, I really like the Prime, but I know for other players, the X probably will fit your game for you as well. But I recommend, hey, get a testing pack, check these out, and uh, I could for sure see myself putting these in my bag this season.